How to draw the snake boss from Stickman War. I will show you the whole process from beginning to end in this video. For this tutorial, you will need a pencil, a black marker, with preferably a small tip, an eraser, and some gray and blue colors. Okay, so once you got all of that, let's start with step one, sketching. First, start drawing a line. This will later represent the body of your snake. You can choose any shape you like with it. After that, draw an upside down triangle at the place where the head should be later. Also, don't worry about mistakes. Since all of this is just a rough sketch, we will erase this later. When you are done with that, you can start giving your snake's body some proportion. While doing that, make sure that the thickness of the snake's body is always roughly the same, except for the last few parts of its body. You can start making it thinner there. Once you got the body, start with the so-called hood that cobras have. To do that, just add some simple curves that get thinner the more you get to the bottom, to the left and right side of the snake's head. Now let's get to the face. The first step is to add the gem as sort of an orientation point. Place it on top in the middle of the triangle. From there on, we are gonna separate the face into two shapes, a bean on top and a triangle on the bottom. Now inside of the big bean, you will draw the snake's eyes and nose. As well, the eye shapes are just beans again. And the nose is really simple too. For the triangle on the bottom, you will need to flatten out its bottom part, draw four teeth and the snake's tongue. And finally, just add these few lines to the gem to finish it off. Now we are just refining the snake. Add some lines, maybe remove some. Make the lines you like best a little stronger until you like your drawing. I also added the crescent shaped blade at the end of the snake's tail, gave it some pupils and added some lines along its belly. And now, done. Congrats, you are done with the sketch. Now let's start with step two, inking. Grab your black pen and start with by far the easiest step. Just draw over every line you want to keep and be careful not to do mistakes since you won't be able to erase them this time. When you think you're done, just double check one more time to see if you missed a line and if you're confident you can erase all your pencil lines so only the black clean lines are left. And done. That was easy, right? Now we need to do step three, coloring. Here I will start with the darkest parts of the snake and also add a few more lines on the snake's skin, just like that. Now, I will also color every bigger space in between those lines on the body in my dark gray color too. Now let's give the underside of the snake's body, as well as the underside of the hood, a light gray color, just like this. And when you are done with that, we can start with the face. Make the inside of the mouth black, the tongue red, the teeth wide, and the eyes and the gem in a greenish blue. Also for the pupils, they are in sort of a rice shape, and I also added two little white circles to make it appear as if there was light reflecting off them. Now take your blue color and fill in every space that is left on the snake's body, from the little crescent shape to its head. Fill in each stripe. Okay, now once you are satisfied, we are going to start with shading, which is technically simple if you know how to do it. Just grab a slightly darker version of your current color and draw in the places where you would imagine no light. These could be the underside of the snake's body at the bottom or little creases. Just make the places that light can't reach that easy a little darker. And that is basically it. If you want to share your drawing, you can do that with the hashtag StickmanWartTutorial, so I may see it. And also, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe. See you in the next one.